Welcome to the Superfast iDot MX8 Quad Max demonstration of an IVI system. So we've got our Quad Max uh, simple system right here, driving three full displays. This is the 3840 by 1440, and I've got two 1080p panels uh, down here simulating a center stack control panel, which you'll see in a moment, uh, as well as a rear seat entertainment. Obviously, you can put the screens wherever you'd like. On the top, on uh, kicking it upstairs, uh, you've got what uh, is a representation of a cluster. So you've got Prindle as well as uh, information on how fast the car is going, navigation and map, plus at least front seat uh, control of what media uh, you're currently listening to. So let's say that uh, you're on a long drive and you want to go check out some videos or some entertainment options. Um, what we're going to do, launch Chrome and find a video that we think is interesting to play with. I think I've found just a randomly interesting video to uh to show you and if you'll bear with me these are not touch screen enabled so i'm having to use a mouse obviously in a real car you'll have a lot more sleek stylish and beautiful um options to control your content so i've got my i've got my uh video playing let's assume that that's on the center console and maybe the passenger's checking that out uh see something that is interesting um, and you want to show the driver. Let's say that we are in some sort of a self-driving car, maybe a level three. Uh, so move that uh, picture in picture around uh, to give me a little bit of room. And I'm going to swipe down here and switch apps. So pull this up. Grab that screen and there we go. So now I've Kicked it upstairs, I've got the video playing, everybody can see it on the uh, large pillar-to-pillar -pillar screen uh, in full detail. And as you're playing with that, you might uh, browse other web uh, sites, go up to other video, other types of content, use Netflix, Hulu, whatever streaming service you want uh, at very fast frame rates. Um, once you're done, uh, you're tired of seeing the content, maybe you wanna kick it back to somebody that's in the third seat of your SUV. Let's switch back to, um, let's switch back to our infotainment system. And now we're going to go talk to the rear seat entertainment system by sending it that same video. We thought it was interesting. And we want people, hopefully you can see it with the glare on the LCDs, you can see that video starting to play. And to wrap it all up, uh, I'm in the middle seat and I'm super bored, so what I want to do is start playing some games. Grab this. And unfortunately, I just showed you how you can now play Angry Birds on a full pillar-to-pillar -pillar LCD. That was not what was a part of the demo, but now you can see Angry Birds playing on the big screen. Let's try that again. And switch back to the infotainment screen. Now on this built-in screen, again, I'm the board guy in the middle of the car. And then Angry Birds starts up. And I'm not going to wait for that to load, but basically we're able to play a full game on that. So three independent screens with independent content, web browser in the bottom left, game in the middle, and your full IVI system uh, up top. Thanks for watching.